Iran. Coronavirus fatalities exceed 39,000. The MEK announced on Monday that the coronavirus death tolls exceeded 39,000 in 312 cities across Iran. At Sina Hospital in Tehran, the necessary equipment for doctors and nurses has been minimised. Hospital control is in the hands of the so-called ideological and political mercenaries, and anyone who protests will be fired. If someone is filming, they will be interrogated and their phones confiscated. On the other hand, during the coronavirus crisis, the regime's parliament passed a bill to change the national currency from rials to tomans, eliminating four zeros from the currency. Mariam Rajavi, the president-elect of the NRI, described the inevitable action following the rials' free fall as the most important side of the official recognition of the crushing economic bankruptcy. Iran. 50 women infected with the coronavirus in prison. According to a shocking report from Avaz's Sebedal prison, at least 50 women are infected with the coronavirus in Avaz, but are denied access to medical facilities and care, and have often not been quarantined. According to reports, the authorities have maintained silence about the spread of the outbreak among the female inmates, and do not report on their condition. Mariam Rajavi, the president-elect of the National Council of Resistance of Iran, strongly condemned this inhumane treatment of the oppressed female prisoners, and called on United Nations High Commissioner for Human Rights, Shel Bacalet, to take action to save the lives of these prisoners. Iran. Political prisoners violently relocated within Tehran Penitentiary. Prison guards at the Great Tehran Penitentiary violently transferred four imprisoned Gonabadi Deveshes to another ward on May 2nd, endangering their lives amid the coronavirus. The transfer of the four violates the law regarding the separation of prisoners based on the type of crime. The prison guard tried to transfer each of the four to a separate ward, but the Deveshes resisted and subsequently the guards were compelled to transfer all four to the ward five. Iranian political prisoners continue to be transferred to and held in prisons and wards with inmates convicted of violent crimes or with substance abuse issues.